Hello, this is Danny at Bradley James Classics. I'm bringing you a very beautiful modern classic Jaguar from the mid 1990s. This is easy, easily the best condition XJ40 that I've ever offered. Now I'm a real big Jag fan and it pains me to actually sell this car because it just drives so beautifully and I've always been a fan of the XJ40 but then again um, we've, we've got a uh, an XJ1 here and we've also got the uh, Coupe which is the XJ2 as a Series 3 XJ12 uh, plus some uh, old ones including the 420 and the Mark 10 around at the moment so as you can imagine that's quite a lineup. Now this car really does look as good in real life as it does in these photos and I'm going to give you a close-up walk around video just spitting of rain which is a bit cruel because uh, we've just given the car a little wash for this photo shoot and video but I'm showing you that there's absolutely no rust on this car I'm showing you that there's no dents there is a distinct lack of stone chips the car has been loved and adored a single owner through to last year and the car is absolutely beautiful and those who know their Jaguars will recognize this is quite a rare model it's a sport model and uh, the subtleties of the sport I think look absolutely fantastic and in this color which again I've been well known for saying this about Jaguars this rich red which we see our fair share of here it's just for me easily the best color for them the optional electric sunroof and probably one of the nicest things about this car is looking well other than the stunning interior on the outside look how lovely it is sorry stunning exterior do you know it's got that jaguar smell it's 74,000 miles full history pretty much every piece of documentation a couple of sets of keys one of the nice things about the sport is the interior look how good it is rear seats are not having two sets of mats and then we've got the red carpeting which matches the exterior in fact the wood really sets off well the color of the badges and of course being a car that was just starting to take technology on board I notice there's a lack of a glove box there with the airbag you'll see an onboard computer you'll see a amplified radio and all the usual Jaguar refinements in which there are many but if I just talk about the sport differences now we can see them at the front the distinctive grille uh, you can notice those headlamps are all the same colour through there. You'll notice the um, mirrors have been colour coded in with the rest of the car. The distinctive sport alloys. That infill panel looks wonderful from the back. Lovely bright chrome, which is lovely underneath, never been welded. The bodywork is immaculate. These, benef these, be these cars benefit from. Um, a sport suspension from the factory and fog lamps were another benefit of this particular car and you'll notice those upper then lower gold stripes again these are all sport uh, extras can you see the matte window surrounds here? Look how lovely that looks against the chrome backdrop. There's your 3.2S ruby red, really suits this particular colour. And along with the stiffer dampers, you've got an uprated anti roll bar so got an absolutely wonderful ride and the car drives like it's new it looks absolutely wonderful its road presence is great I keep wandering around it just in case you see something different now the the engine compartment is 
Well, it's one of those cars that if you were into that sort of thing, you could show up at a car show, open your bonnet up, and you'd have people flocking around it going, well, wow, because you just do not see cars in this condition very often. And that's why this one is an absolute delight. Look at that under there. This car has been loved and fettled. Full service history. It hasn't done a lot of miles for its years. And it's so super clean. It's a real credit to the previous owner. As I say, it's a single owner through to 2016. Loved and cared. All of the original manuals. You'll see a photograph showing all of those. It's original sort of brochure from when the car was new. Very Jaguar. Now people can get quite nostalgic over Jaguar, but I've got to say the XJ40 Ford had got involved. You can tell by looking at the car key. Um, they needed their luxury car division, they bought Jaguar. And I've got to say for me, the XJ40 was very much the last of the old guard. I've always been a big fan of the XJ, right through from the first series, but this is every inch a Jaguar. Um, well, just a, a classy, stylish car, which has such wonderful presence. Excuse my work bag. Let's just move these out so you can see how clean it is in the boot here. It doesn't look like to have had a lot of uh, use either. Look at that. Fantastic headlining. I think I mentioned the uh, optional electric sunroof. Everything works. An absolute pleasure to drive. Whenever we get cars in this condition, they always go pretty quickly. So I suggest you uh, make a call early on. Come and see us. And once you've driven this car and once you've seen it, you're going to want to buy it. You're going to want to drive it home. Let me just show you in that interior once more. Sports seats. Sorry, I didn't mention that earlier. Obviously, you Lovely leather. Look at the way it combines the colour schemes with the oatmeal. Wonderful. Good condition headlining. All the clicks on the switches all feel like new. It really feels like this car's had minimal wear. Delight to drive. Well, folks, I hope this uh, walk around video has given you an idea of the condition of this XJ. Please get in touch. Arrange to uh, come and see a uh,